Sarah Elway gritted her teeth as she tried to get comfortable in the back seat of the rickety bus that seemed to be on the verge of shaking apart completely. She'd been expecting the roads of Scotland to be rocky, but she'd assumed that the vehicles would have at least some kind of suspension in them. That didn't seem to be the case here. And to make things worse, she was stuck in the back of the bus, surrounded by a bunch of half-drunk tourists who were clearly more interested in the nightlife of Scotland than the sights. Then again, she supposed she couldn't judge. At 34, she was almost too old to have signed up for a tour like this one. But she'd done so with a distinctly ulterior motive. An ulterior motive that had obsessed her for the last four years and counting. An ulterior motive that made any amount of travel sickness more than worth it. An ulterior motive that went by the name of Damon de Beers. She finally found a comfortable spot and leaned against the window, staring out at the rather beautiful countryside beyond. She was a long way from home. Sarah had never been particularly interested in travel. Boston was home, and any trip further than the state border of Massachusetts had never piqued her interest. No, this trip was strictly business. Her work had never taken her to the other side of the world before, though, and despite her laser focus on her objective, it had been interesting to learn a little bit more about the world outside of her hometown. The tour bus had been a cost-cutting measure, mostly. There were hundreds of old ruins in this part of Scotland, and the info she had on De Beers just said he'd stashed the jewels in the ruins of an ancient old building on the Isle of Skye. Probably a castle, her source had said, though they hadn't been certain. At the time, she'd been thrilled. How many castles could there be in such a small area? But a quick call to a travel agent had dashed her hopes. There were dozens of places that fit the bill. A few more phone calls had shown her that the cheapest way of getting to as many old ruins as possible was by taking a castle tour. So here she was, sitting at the back of a bus full of rowdy young tourists from around the world, playing the part of a tourist, and quietly searching every ruin they visited for a stash of hidden jewels.